Trudeau frustrated at unvaccinated Canadians. Canadians throw a party on a sunwing flight. And a friend of mine is shot in Toronto. This is the Great White North Report. I'm in love with the system. Never going home. I'm in love. All right, Trudeau says he, Canadians are angry at the unvaccinated. Trudeau is playing with fire here, I think. He's trying to shame the unvaccinated into becoming vaccinated. And he's dividing Canadians against one against the other. Now, Trudeau's using the reason that people are seeing cancer treatments and elective surgeries put off because beds are filled with people who choose not to get vaccinated. They're frustrated when people see that we're in lockdowns or serious public health restrictions now because of all the risks posed to us by unvaccinated people, people get angry. Well, the thing is, you can stick with the virus if you're vaccinated and you can give it to other people. And the, vac the vaccine works differently to other people. People have different side effects to it. My own position, personal feeling is, like the virgin said, it's gotta be done. I am vaccinated. I'm not gonna get the booster, not anytime soon anyway, unless it becomes absolutely necessary. And I understand why people are sometimes leery about vaccinations, only because this one was rushed so, so badly and quickly. So we really don't know what the long-term effects are gonna be because we didn't exactly have years to study the effects of the vaccines that we're giving. So there are people who are a little bit leery about the vaccines. There's some that got it even though they didn't want to because they had to or they wouldn't be able to go to work. You know, the whole rapid test thing, who knows how accurate that is. I had to do it before I went back to work. I was cracking jokes during the, during the rapid test because if it's one bar, it means a negative. If it's two bars, it's a positive, right? So I was saying if it's one bar, Negative, two bars, congratulations. If it's if it's blue, it's a boy. If it's pink, it's a girl. If you see three bars, you have to bend, drop your pants and bend over. You know, just try and make fun, have some fun with it. I think Trudeau is just trying to shame those unvaccinated people and to set vaccinated people against unvaccinated people. And that's divisive politics. That's not something good. I can understand being angry at something, but the vaccinated are spreading it to the unvaccinated by going outside and all that stuff. I don't like wearing a mask. But then again, if this clown had done his job in the first place and closed the border, closed, stopped all flights from, to China, from China in the early days of the pandemic, and also partnered with Pfizer instead of trying to partner with Sinopec, you know, we wouldn't be in this. This mess wouldn't be so bad. You look at the states, look at the, when they have their bowl games, look how many people are at a game. It's unbelievable. Because in the minds of many people, the unvaccinated are the, are the redneck conservatives. But I tell you, there's a lot of liberal-minded people who aren't, who aren't vaccinated because they don't believe in it. But my take is, you know, you should get vaccinated. You know, I'm not pressuring anybody to do it. Unvaccinated, you shouldn't be going out into, like, closed public places. And you definitely should be wearing a mask. I would personally rather see everyone vaccinated. But at the same time, I'm not going to force anyone at the moment. Unless it becomes more deadly. But time will tell. Which brings us to the uh, the Sunwing party flight. Now these little entitled brats partying on a plane. One chick's vaping on a on a plane. All no masks, having a great time on a plane down to Cancun, while people in Quebec are are locked down. You know the sheer stupidity of their actions is unbelievable, and the level of ego that these people float above uh, above the rest of us. Well, I hope they get fined when they come home. And definitely socially embarrassed, socially embarrassed on social media. In fact, only a quarter of them have, have so far found their way back to Canada because Sunwing canceled their flight back home. Plus three other airlines, I believe, canceled flights. They've had to find their own way home. So let's hope we uh, press charges on these idiots because they make, make the rest of us look bad. While the rest of us are trying to do our part to, to keep everyone safe and, and healthy, these idiots are out here having a good time. That's one reason why I don't go to resorts. If I want to see a bunch of drunk white people, I'll go to Richmond Row. Why would I want to spend my vacation down in Cancun looking at drunken white people partying on the sand? I saw enough of that in Boracay. So there was 130 passengers. Images and videos from the flight show passengers ignoring public health measures, jumping and dancing in the aisle, vaping, openly passing a bottle of hard liquor on the plane. If there's a person on there that had the virus and, what, and some people weren't vaccinated or lied about their vaccination, that can have some very serious effects. Or when they go down to Cancun, if people there aren't vaccinated and one, and one of them had it, you know, the stupidity of these people just amazes me. And they should be in, indeed fined. Maybe spend a few days in jail, teach them a lesson. Now on a more personal note, 
On December 12th, there was a, a shooting in Toronto on Dundas and Young Street. At the time, I didn't think anything of it. You know, this is Toronto. People get shot there all the time. It's a hole. I mean, we never want to live in Toronto. The guy who got shot was a guy I actually worked with. And he's just a kid. Happened to be at the wrong place at the wrong time. And um, I thought, you know, I didn't think much of it when he didn't show back up to work that last week. For the last three three weeks. Not counting the holidays. You know, because people come and go where I work all the time. And then to find out he'd been shot, I was kind of, I was, you know, that's too bad. I hope he, they, I hope they catch this, these clowns, these two guys. Because apparently they tried to, they came up to the group where my buddy was. You know, to him, tried to rob them and the shots were fired and my buddy got hit in the chest. So hopefully he pulls through. This is why we need to come down harder on illegal guns. Any Canadians, let me know what you guys think about the unvaccinated. Your opinion on that. Also about the idiots on the Sunwing flight. What should we do with them? And uh, leave comments in the comment section. Hit the subscribe button if you're new to the channel. And until next time, this has been the Great White North Report. I'm in love.